Since the Industrial Revolution, humans have emitted, in total, somewhere between 1 to 2 trillion tons of CO2. That number is impossible to fathom, but we've got to get it out. We've got to support the planet's natural healing processes and start pulling down this gas that is driving catastrophic climate events everywhere across the planet. Noya is on a mission to accelerate the world's transition to carbon negativity, re retrofit existing pieces of industrial equipment like cooling towers and turn them into carbon vacuums. I run because it's something I picked up from my mom. My mom was a single parent in the army and I went out running with her when I was little. I like being able to zone out and enjoy the countryside here in the Bay Area. I was super fortunate to be the first person in my family to go to college and even more fortunate beyond that to go to MIT. My co-founder Daniel is the total yin to my yang. We both grew up in Latino families, both studied engineering in college, and both really wanted to do something that made an impact in the world. One day I was on the train reading some sort of doom-scrolling type of article about trees and CO2. And I just remember thinking, what if we just had a way to reverse the damage that we've done here? What if carbon removal could generate value instead of being a societal cost? I approached him and said, hey, I think we should work on this. We were trying to figure out a way to rapidly scale direct air capture processes. So Daniel burst into the room he said, we need to use these things called cooling towers. And I said, what the heck's a cooling tower? And he started explaining it to me, and I just realized this could be the solution that we were looking for. The US is home to two million cooling towers, and a key characteristic of how cooling towers work is that they move a lot of air through them and put that air into contact with water. As air and water meet, some of the water evaporates cooling the water that remains, and that cool water is sent to cool down some type of large-scale process, like boilers or turbines. After cooling that process down, the water goes back to the cooling tower, and round and round it goes. So cooling towers are incredibly vital to efficient performance of many industrial systems. Our technology works by first installing a piece of equipment directly in the path of flow of air as it's entering the cooling tower. Inside of that equipment is a solid CO2 capture material, like a sponge, and it soaks up CO2 from the air. Like all sponges, our sponge sometimes gets full. The second piece of equipment provides the heat that we need to release the CO2 that we've captured. And the CO2 we collect on site. It gets injected deep underground for permanent sequestration, and that generates carbon credits. We sell those credits. It's by radically reducing both the upfront capital cost and the installation time that's typically required to perform direct air capture. We are going to be able to have the fastest impact on solving this problem. Using our technology, we can capture about 20% of global emissions, and that's just looking at US equipment. If we look globally, that number expands to almost meet the amount of emissions that we have. So the impact that Noya's technology can have is incredibly motivating. My sister is seven years old right now, she has these big plans for what she wants to do and, and who she wants to be. She literally is one of the people that we are trying to ensure the future for. We've seen governments start to fund carbon removal for the first time in our history. We've seen a massive influx of talent into the space, all of which signify that this market is on its way to becoming something huge. That in itself is incredibly exciting. My name is Josh Santos, and I'm the co-founder and CEO of Noya.